Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and guess what? It's Demolition Day. Yep, I think it's time we tear down the old front of the colony here. This is the last of the original part of the, uh, of the, of the, of the, the tent city that we had built here before we dug into the mountain. And oh man, did we dig. <laughs> dug and dug and dug. Um... What was I thinking? Oh, over here, I, I queued up a little more, too. I'm going to have them... We got started on the doors over here. In fact, it was Klaus and Handy. Kathra wanted over here for something. She wants to go harvest something. There's Klaus. He's dropping off more goods. Klaus is going to remove a roof, huh? Um, Handy? Removing a roof. Can I, can I get you to you know finish the... the need components. <laughs> well, we can work on this one. Components, components, components. I thought we had a pile. I guess we wiped out a pile somewhere. They were right there. Oh, there. Ooh. When we f we did find that last time. Okay. I need an Alicia. <laughs> You're down here. Uh, Miss B's sleeping and Sea Stars is going to sleep going to get a dinner and go to sleep. Alicia, you are in great shape. If I could just get you there, that's the problem. That's a long way to go. So if I can get you to... Hmm... Yeah. If I can get you to do this one. That. That. And then work your way over to... That. Maybe... Four squares is enough to get you all the way up through the base and through there and across the river. And yeah, I think that'll get you there. Because as we go, Alicia, we're going to see this starting to tick off. You're only good for, I don't know what it is, 20 seconds. And Why is there a turkey over here? There is a turkey over here. You're starving. You're leaving the map. Um, yeah, there's, there's, there's turkey dinner right there. Uh, handy. Get, you still got the minigun? Oh boy. Oh boy, I gotta get an assault rifle back on you. And the turkey's going... Where? How does that turkey think it's getting off the map? By going all the way down there. Interesting. Okay. Well, um, Handy, I guess, dive down a little bit lower. Because he's now fleeing for his life by, or she by swimming away but come on down over here I know we're a little distracted around my he's just just flying out of there come on down over here that should give you enough room oh you're 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 okay fire at where do you think you're going now you're going up the other side okay and it is an assault rifle or a, a minigun so okay this is supposed to be just a quick little thing it's just a you know spur of the moment um let's just take a turkey dinner out of here ah close that was touch which means what minigun information touch accuracy one and two is going to hit okay that's a lot better anyway can you break and hmm i'll bet you somebody else will come up and get that why don't you do me a favor and work on that door Thank you. Bet you the exact amount of steel you need is right in there. Alicia, you made it. Come on over here now and make me some of these. Cancel and make me some of these. Thank you. Perfect. Now, where was I? Mm, we were tearing down in here. Of course, we're only tearing roofs down, which is probably a good idea. Yeah, first. But let's let's get all of these roofs down. Let's see if we can see them. Okay. What was that? Extreme break risk, Bill. Oh, he's our 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 uh, our sad wanderer has has come back. He's no, he's still wandering. Oh, I see. Needs we finally got below that line. Ah, he's not back yet. He's still roaming the prison, singing Johnny Cash songs. So that's what was that noise? I don't know what I just heard. It sounded like a pterodactyl just flew over the top, but oh well. Something. <laughs> I'm sure it's nothing. Don't worry about it. <laughs> You're removing a roof and you are so determined. You need a component. You need a component. You need a component. And do we have a component? No, we don't. Tell you what. 
let them tear the roofs down. Can you tear this area down for me? Deconstruct, let's just work through the list here and do that one, then do this one and that one and that one. Then we'll see if you can't build a, a door. So you're doing all that. I don't think anything can collapse here. Though this is an indoors, which is not going to be an indoors anymore, but I don't see where that's a problem. In fact, it's time to pull out all these graves as well and, and get uh, all this stuff incinerated and cleaned up. And and all this stuff has been waiting for 100 episodes. Yeah. Do we... There, there's a dog took a turkey. Okay. Do we have one yet? Alicia, one more, two more taps. And gotcha. So with that, handy... Next is going to be that door. Perfect. I think it's two each. Yeah, two components. So, oh, that was a quick little vein of components. That's it? That doesn't even need one. Hmm. Okay, well, we're going to get four out of this. I'm going to hang around in case one shows up there or something. Kind of an odd-shaped little component vein, but... Uh, or machinery, compact machinery vein. Minor break risk is Bill. Bill is back among the living. He's gone to bed. He got food. He's going to be just fine. He's got a 40-point catharsis going on. He's going to be the happiest guy in town. <laughs> David said, David said, just you know, pick him up and throw him in the river, and he'll, uh, um, he'll, he'll get over it. But uh, splash some cold water on him. <laughs> um, let's see. You're bringing in stuffs. I set up a temp or a a uh, stockpile zone for steel because we keep making it over here, and there's never anywhere to put it. I saw it right there, and other places, and so it just gets dropped in places, and I can't move it. I'm always adding more. So let's ambrosia sprouts. So, grove of mysterious ambrosia bush has sprouted nearby. If you wait for the plants to grow, you'll be able to harvest the delicious, pleasurable, and slightly addictive fruit. Ah, right over in there. Okay. Haven't dealt with those yet. Probably never will, but we'll just say thank you anyway. So, anyway, we were over in here. Handy's putting the final touches there. She's getting granite blocks, hopefully for 12 of 25. Hopefully she brings enough for all of them even though these don't have the components yet. Though we do have components now. Hmm, handy when you're, in fact, why don't you go and do this one right now? Just to get a hold of those components before anybody else does. I want that back perimeter sealed. Then we can bust through the rest of this and kind of finish our pathway here. It'd be so nice to be able to go from here to there without taking the river route and working our way through and all that. So that's that's one goal that's been waiting all this time, but there's no point in, in having all of this maze or labyrinth going on that we've had before. Once we have these two doors, I can even take this out. I wonder if I get any components back. If I take one of these, oh, it's just a granite door. No, okay. So I'll wait until these three are in. And we still need to do that one. That's just a granite door as well. Okay. So up in here, we won't tear any of these out until all the construction jobs are done. They won't deconstruct till the construct is finished. So I need to manually set these. Gnarly, you are joying up really good and your mood's in great shape and you've got a beautiful environment and luxuriantly comfortable and ate a fine meal and spacious interior and joy filled and feeling good and slightly impressive bedroom. I think you can handle this. Come on over here. Let's just set you up to do all this. And after the episode is over, I'll queue up the a thousand and one uh, uh, wood floor squares to be torn out and then maybe I'll well I hit a prioritize something it's given birth I don't know what that last one's going to be there but well oh I see one of them may have been conduit or something hmm okay we'll take this down any more roofs available we're not roofed in there we're not roofed in there and this is overhead mountain okay and this let's kill any roofs in this area just to to get rid of any possibility of doing some weird crazy things you know we'll decide to mine this out one day and all of a sudden this line here collapses and and uh, kill somebody <laughs> horrible end of the series <laughs> lots of wood coming in good uh, turn that off and yeah gnarly he's gone he's out of here um, 
Oh, he went right back to play poker with George. How do you say no to that? You, you go for it. Have fun. Um, David, you are using the telescope. Okay. Do you need? No, you don't. You don't really need it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna uh, uh, draft you over here to get you to tear this area out. I'll do that because you could do it faster than I can click it. Hmm. You can diagonal that one, but let's just head down the inside first. Let's open this whole area up. I see that one and that one. That one. That one. I don't think the conduit gives anything back. I think it's just one steel per conduit. Uh, probably not the best plan there, but let's go ahead and do that anyway. So I'm pretty sure that you, uh, you know, you get back only a percentage and I'm a percentage of one is less than one, so you're not going to get anything more. All right, these are all going down. And we'll stop there. Yeah, we'll see where that goes. This has to be taken out. Um, is it already uninstalled? Maybe there's a symbol hiding back in there. I see the, uh, the no power symbol. I don't see an uninstall. I must be what this cancel is. Okay. So in that case, David, you can deconstruct. Ah, that's what it is. So deconstruct cooler, deconstruct vent, deconstruct vent. Let's get all these torn down. Vent. And let's uninstall that one. Uninstall, uninstall. Okay. We're making it official here. Then when you're done, swing back over to this area. Because your needs were fine, yeah. Everybody else is going to be doing all kinds of things. They're going to be building half the uh, the colony while I'm concentrating on David here. But let's see, I get you to do this also as I notice them. So we're dropping steel. Oh, we're dropping components. Okay, give me that second component. There, stop right there. I need a Handy or an Eric. What we got? Eric, you're kind of in this area. You are building power conduit. You need to rest soon. Uh, Klaus, you're resting in great shape. You need food. And you're consuming a fine meal right now. You're thinking about it. You're going to do that, and then you're going to do... Where am I? Here. We got... Oh, someone walked through the door. Okay. You're going to do... Granite block auto door. Okay, I, didn't, I was looking for the word auto door. You're going to do that, and that's going to claim at least the two. Okay. Maybe we can get another one to drop here soon. Though these don't have them. It's only the coolers. Yeah, that's the end of it. So there's one there. Oz is making a beeline for it. No. Any of you show up over here? No. Um, Natalia, I just saw you. There you are. What you doing? You are cutting stone blocks. Isabel's pregnant. Let's have you instead work on this and give me one more of those. So Klaus is going to grab the two. He already, no, yeah, he will soon. And maybe he'll grab the one as well. Maybe he'll grab all the components that are available. Hopefully. Uh, Miss B and C Star is going to clean this area up. Good. So, little by little. Um, just had a thought and I lost it. What was I going to do in the meantime was kind of what I was thinking. Um, well, we're at 2300. Everybody's kind of going to bed. And they kind of are in bed. I don't see anybody in the hallways that I can get to. George, you didn't get there quick enough. Yep. But is there a room that I can get you to touch up that isn't already with somebody sleeping? That's really not. And actually, they're looking really good. I see dirt all over Kaya's room. She stomped in some mud. But everybody else looks nice and clean. Okay, never mind. Go have, a, have a ball. You've got plenty of food for the night. Eric, you have got food for the night. You just grabbed dinner. Okay. And day shift is sleeping. Daniel, you're resting. Oh, I thought you were going to the hospital to rest. I was scratching my head there. You're heading down into your room down there. Okay. And Oath Knight, I did swap out your normal um, marble bed for a superior wooden bed that was up in one of these rooms here. Actually, it was right It was right here. So, in fact, I scratched my head trying to figure out why I could not get you or anybody else to put that in. It was sitting right there. It was cued to go 
in, and I'll finish that story later. Tornado. <laughs> so, is this the last episode of the series? I guess that's a valid question right now. Wow. Anyway, to finish that quick story, I could not get him to pick up this bed because there wasn't a door here. The door was right there. And it was just sealed in by this wall. But, tornado. Oh, man. No. 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 Ah, well. Boy. Let her rip. It's damaging the walls. It's damaging them. So far, we're okay. Two tornadoes in one series. Well, two tornadoes in almost 175 episodes, so at close to an hour each. So I guess in that case, no, they're not that common. Trees are being damn three out of 300. That one almost went down. Are you really going off the map just like that? You left the map. Oh, we got lucky. Woo! Okay. Well, unfortunately, I can't repair the the ones on the, in the middle. And there's a lot of damage in there. But we're just going to have to call those good. Okay, well, I don't think we lost anything. I didn't see any messages pop up. There weren't any animals out here. There were no people out here. May have lost a squirrel or something, but... Ah, boy... We got off really well. That's two tornadoes, and, and twice we had almost no damage. Nardo's going to go take care of the damage that he can find instead of work on... Hold on. David, you are repairing granite wall. Um, Jir, Tomislav, you are researching. You're up for the day. Ah, you're mine. Okay. They're going to go do all that. We're going to take some walls down. So, top choice. Now, can I do this faster than you? Oh, I'm not holding the shift down. That's why none of that registered. Okay, right there. Try that again. Okay, top choice. So he can do it about as fast as I can get my fingers to do all the clickety clicks. So, oh, he's he's gaining on me. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh, what? Huh? What? Are you really going to go play chess first? Um, um, no. <laughs> okay, we're going to do it this way. Then somehow it threw that order in right in between one of my clicks, and I held the shift button down, and it absorbed it. So we'll just keep it on pause then. All right. So with that, we'll have a lot more wood more stuff to haul away and with that wood maybe we can get some more of those shelving units built so I can start loading them up did you not get this you did not get this okay and I don't know if you got that door or not and oh we have got an orbital trade beacon over here that's right I really need one over here I've been putting things on shelves I don't think now oh, they are still in range we need to get this one done so one step down on the conduit and in line with that cancel it's still there. Okay, let's try that again. You go there. There we go. I need this guy to go over here. Install, reinstall, right there. Okay, and that covers this whole corner of it. We'll have another one here, which will cover this whole corner of it. And then this guy up here covers the rest of it. So there's three beacons at 40 watts each. That's not too expensive. We can do that. So, Tomislav, that one, that one. Don't want you to make the trip yet. Let's go ahead and... Oops, nope. There. There. Okay, now I think I've got ahead of you. There. There. Oh, you're definitely going to deconstruct power conduit much faster than I can find it on a list. Yeah. Where are you? There you are. When it gives me more than one choice, and I have to read. Now that just, yeah, that, that makes life tough. There. And no, I can't talk. <laughs> I am. 
Right, right click or left click? No, let's see. That's a right. No, that's a left. No, no, that one's a. Yeah. Uh huh. I'll uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Deconstructing. There we go. Muscle memory. Keep them going. Keep them going. Right there. And take this one down while you're at it. And that's still that got missed. Uninstall that one. Whew. There's a few more. I can. Okay, I can breathe now. You're going there. There. I think I got that one. There. And you still didn't get this one, so I'll put that back in there again. Is that all of them? That one? Then I guess move this one when it's all done. And I think it's all done. Okay. So with that, come on up and install power conduit, orbital trade beacon right there. And then I guess work on the power conduit. Although, I want you to do that when you're up here, because you'll go all the way back to grab steel from down here. But we have one component left. We have, ooh, no, it's still the original three? Did Klaus never get here? Did he get distracted? Where is here? Here's right there. He got distracted. So, Klaus, where are you right now? You are off repairing Granite Wall, along with David and Gnarly, and Vliss and Radar are sleeping, and Eric is sleeping, and Kaya is sleeping, and that is the end of my constructors okay so it'll have to be a project for tomorrow hopefully nobody goes to build something else instead we'll see we're good here we're good here can i take these down i can i don't see any reason why not there's no roof here and whatever we do we're going to build with with construction materials anyway sure let's take that group down that shouldn't cause a problem. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Between, well, eleven, maybe from there to there. I think we're still fine roof wise. Okay. So before we take any of this out, though, or this, we need to think about a support column until we figure out. In fact, let's just put that in. Before we uh, mess up at all, let's just make sure that's sitting right out there, smack dab in the middle, and, and somebody goes to work on it. Oh, you're. I didn't stop you. Bliss, you can take this one. Why don't you go clean that up? Sangrit, you're off starting your day. Bill is picking up all this wood and going where with it? Bill the dog. Where are you heading at four each? Oh good, you're heading down into the base. Head down into like right here so that uh, we can build these. In fact, do we have a builder down here? Let's get a builder before they all head out to... Where's Radar? To uh, work on that wall. Because that wall is going to take them quite some time to clean up once they're done all with all this you see all the damage here all the damage there they're going to be half the episode because the block walls take a long time to repair and build and deconstruct um i'm gonna build over here cutting stone blocks making up for all that lost time natalia is still making components she got one out over there needs let's break her now she's going to continue good so that way she can leave if she gets hungry and we still haven't taken this one down. So shift and deconstruct that one for me. Dogs are putting everything away. And I need that builder. Vliss, where did you ever end up right now? You are, oh, you're right here in front of me. I was thinking that that was somebody else and you were up here. Okay, so when you're done with that, you're right here at the components. You are going to go and drop components in all over the place over here. Um, no, no. Come over and do this one then. Somehow you gotta be able to grab components. There we go, and that's it. Okay, let's think about that. We've got everything there but one component. Everything there, everything there. Oh, good. Our three doors will finally be done. So once that's done, not until I'm gonna go ahead and mark these to to uh, to tear up or to, to, to mine, but we'll have another tornado or something drop in and then we'll have an open back door and yeah things happen they just do you guys hopefully having a good time over there having a deep conversations and animals how are we doing fox anastasia's pregnant and we had a boom a little, a little while ago that popped up that's right What's going over here? Can I faith you yet? I cannot. There's still one more thing to do, and faith doesn't have the qualification to right there. Need a level six 
in order to do release for a squirrel, which I think would just be kind of fun. But let's turn you off, you off. You are now a nun. You are now a nun. These are puppies, right? Yeah. So that's all correct. Scrolling down here. And you are a nun. Don't want you to, to uh, bond to, to Sangria. Otherwise, we have the potential of having a very depressed Sangria all the time. If we let all these animals bond to her and something goes wrong, like, you know, we can't afford to feed them anymore and we decide to eat them or sell them. Um, booms have all landed in the right place from there to there. We have three calves and four adults. And pretty soon we're going to be out of eating out of house and, and uh, kibble with all these guys. One, two, three, four, five in here. Six is wandering up in there. Sangra's training one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have a lot of them. Sea Star's headed into there. You can see what's down in this direction. Okay, that works. Um, up in here, Vliss, you thought about doing some more and then somebody walked through your workspace. Is that it? I think so. Let's... Hmm. If I could just take these three out, we can get into this so much easier. There is that to think of. But Kaya, you are consuming a fine meal. Okay. Um, you're going where for it? You're not going over here. If you go over here, then you can immediately go up to here afterward and do that. Let's do that. Then you're going to do this. And if someone walks through your space, maybe you'll be able to jump over and continue working on something. Okay, that works. Um, what am I, close to a half hour? Yeah, a lot of meals going on up in here. A lot of cooking going on. We're at 85 uh, fine meals. Uh, how are we doing on space? We're starting to uh, cold a bunch of, of uh, roosters. And we've got a lot of, of uh, kibble storage going on. Over here, we could use some. Hopefully we'll bring... 12 chicken eggs have built up. Oh, man. So, we're going to have a burst of chickens. 91%. Probably this episode. It'd be nice to be here. I've seen it once before. All of a sudden, just an explosion of chickens spawns all over. Or turkeys or what have you. I've seen it when I, when I ran... What? Oh, I thought that pig just sat down and had a meal. But no, we still have 12. Good. Um, so, let's try to remember that. Where are we at now? Eggs were at 92%. Alrighty. So try to remember to go back to there. Klaus, you are continuing to work on a wall. David, you are heading for bed. Needs, you're good on food. Bliss, you are repairing a wall. Um, anything more that I can do for these doors? Who was it that was heading this way? That was Kaya, right? Kaya was having dinner, and she's heading up, and she's, she's right there. Okay, let's get this done. We have another component that is two components are being hauled away to somewhere. Good. Miss P, you are heading this way to go to get a bed. Yep, you're good. Don't need a meal. And we're getting that one built, and we're automatically moving into three, two, one, zero. And we're thinking about it. Okay, let's get these going. Mine into here so we get the conduit going. Take out two of those. Let's erase those two. Good. And Miss P's going to bed. I need an Alicia to give me a, an aisle over here. And you're just in the right area, too. You're digging at limestone. Let's have you dig at mineral, um, uh, granite, and then that one. Yeah, that works. Between those two, that should be about the right distance to get you in there. And if not, you reset to the nearest one, which is right here anyway. So that works. Is that the same two? I think that's the same two. Klaus, you are putting in a roof. Okay. Because that's a room, and that's what you do when you have a room. Uh -huh. uh, no, 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 no. Kaya, you continue. No, you continue. Gonna have to babysit this one, Vliss. Vliss, Vliss. No, 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 no. Then, Vliss, you do it. Fine, you're gonna do that. You're gonna interrupt her? You do it. Kaya says, I'm out of here. I wanna go build a conduit so bad. There's this one way over here, and I have to get there. <laughs> Eric, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. 
Don't do it. Done. Go ahead and do it. That's fine. Oh, he... What? Huh? Um, you gotta get it all the way up there to that other power conduit just, just because. No. Let's do this. Run. We'll run into there. And, Eric, make this happen. Thank you. Alright. So, with that, I was gonna do these two. We could do that. In fact, Eric, that's even more important. Why don't you come over and bring me a whole bunch of blocks. Get that filled in. And hopefully it's enough to actually fill in this one. Maybe that's enough to grab there and these two over here and be done with it. And with that, we can take out this. We'll have three there. We'll have three through here. These can go away. Kind of free up this pathway. Sure. Deconstruct this. In fact, uh, I'll have somebody do that. And that lets us in. In fact, let's conduit the last little bit here. And she, uh, she'll she plow right through this much faster than steel or, or compact machinery. There we are. Right there. All of these new. All of these pull out. There we go. All of those away, piggies. Radar, you are grabbing a block to go and, and uh, continue cutting. Okay, good. So we've got wood in. Can we do any more work in here? I want to get all this fleshed out and see that I like it. And if so, I'll start duplicating everything over here. We're starting to get to where we're not delivering, not putting things away anymore. Why is that there? Someone just abandoned it right then and there. That's interesting. It's 50%. So they don't want it. Huh. But things are not getting put away because we've destroyed all of the the uh, stockpiles by placing all these and cutting them all off. There might be a little bit of stockpile left. Oh, there's a little bit in there. Okay. Bill completed a sculpture. Ooh. But um, so as soon as we get these placed, I need to go through and, and assign everything. Then all the floors should start cleaning up and we'll see how that looks. Let's go look at sculptures real quick. I noticed that uh, somebody had made this one who was that that was cyprian and that one's been installed already but we've got bill just finished a sculpture so has it been delivered cyprian kathra grandma manuela bill just finished a sculpture did i no he didn't there was a bill colon sculpture finished ah somebody ended one of these right there. Cyprian just finished the bill for large sculptures. Aha. Do I want this to go on forever? We could. We're going to use a lot of it in whatever design we come up with over here. So, yeah, let's, well, let's just, let's put in another five. How are we doing here? Let's put in another five. That will get uh, um, Billy back into working. And five, Grandma's got that one. Okay, we'll do that. But what do we have? And we're at 33 minutes, so we won't uh, end it here, but we'll... Uh, a wasted injury. <laughs> Grandma. No, Cyprian. This is a Cyprian one. A wasted... That was really a wasted injury. Okay. Good quality granite large sculpture art. This is a carving... On this carving is an artwork of a chicken trudging through the snow while ex exhaling clouds of fog. A cold blue moon looms in the background. The work is infused with the idea of trouble and is done in a sensual style. The smiling head of a planetologist. Planetologist, yeah, watches overall. What does a planetologist look like? Hmm. This portrayal tells the story of the chicken freezing to death on the 9th of December. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Cyprian. A wasted injury. Okay, I I, I get it. Uh huh. Um, where do you put something like that? Install. That has to go over, it, just to make this a little bit happier place. Over here, I I think so. Um, there isn't a place to put it though, without taking out a stockpile. No, that doesn't work, and it'll scare the chickens. So, no, can't do that. Um, huh. Well, it'd be 
interesting uh, conversation piece for a hospital room. It would. You got, you got to admit that. You are Cyprian. Good. Beauty 150. Granite large sculpture called Patience. This work bears a depiction of two brothers and housewives eating cauliflower together. Well, I guess that takes patience. A dinosaur sits off to one side, and the image somehow expresses both cash and injury. <laughs> so it's the dinosaur that's being patient. I see. Um, okay. Um, hospital room. All else fails. Drop it in a corner in a in a in a recovery room. Yeah, that works. You are Cathra. Beauty 100, good quality, marble sculpture, called together, Red Togetherness. Red Togetherness. This work bears, bears an illustration of five mothers and builders eating tomatoes together. Not cauliflower this time. I think we've got a theme going on. The image somehow expresses both fun and decay. The lower part of the image is dominated by a tree. I'm... Um, um, okay, I think we're going to let that one remain in storage for a little bit. It was only Beauty of 100. Huh. What could we do with that? We've got... Wait a minute. When was... It doesn't say when it was made. But that's a... I had one that was out here though for a long time. And it got dropped off. And it's not... Ah, it was that one? It was an old one that Catherine made a long time ago. Okay, none of those are, and there's nowhere else that's accepting art. And it has been hauled away. So, maybe that was it, but I don't remember reading that before. You'd think you'd remember the five mothers and builders are eating tomatoes together. That's pretty unique. Um, Green Valley by Grandma. Oh, she's getting a lot better now. Superior, wooden, large sculpture called Green Valley. This work resembles a brewer flying through the air holding a dart. <laughs> He's playing darts and he forgot to let go. The scene seems to take place on the outskirts of a burrow. And the very dynamic structure of the image almost conflicts with his sinuous style. 200. I'd say that works for another hospital room right there. There. And we have one more, made by Manuela. I think Manuela can go back to uh, Bill's grandma. Manuela is done. Michael, okay. Manuela, real quick, you have done two works of art, and you, I, I want to get you back into gardening. So let's take that one down, and that is plant cut. It means your first two is grow. Okay, you're back to gardening again. But let's see what you did. We've got a beauty of 270. A superior marble large sculpture. So, the granite large ones are 150. 150. The marble goods are 100. So granite is worth more in beauty than marble. Really? I did not know that. I would think that marble is, you know, you think of using marble for making statues in real life, in the real world. Hmm. Anyway, Marble Superior by Manuela. Eight of Sangria. Beauty of 270. Art. On this sculpture is an illustration of Sangria teaching Hall to a wild boar as Sangria thinks of, of what's for lunch. <laughs> Sangria is smiling. A dentist fades in beneath the main subject, and the image somehow expresses both cruelty and God. The representation tells the story of training the wild boar of 12th of December. Where do you put something like that without upsetting Manuela by giving it to Sangria and then making Manuela's room no longer the best one around? That's something I have to think about. So, how about... That sounds like a great thing to convince future prisoners that this is a great place to uh, um, to to want to join. 
for when they're being talked to while they're still in the hospital beds and you know have their their foot shot off and and uh, you know, yeah okay so we need all the help we can get there um, we're good I think we're good and turn you guys back on and what is next I am not sure but this stuff is out here rotting isn't it it doesn't actually say decaying because it's not on a roof but now it's raining so it could so let's just assign a few things to what would that be in regard to items you storage are not weapons you are let's grab that one and copy and just paste a little bit in here just make it easier um, paste is J and let's go down a little bit none of these have been claimed either we'll just do this for now just to make sure weapons aren't brought down here later I'll go through and get rid of all the art that's gonna land in here even though none will because we're not making it that fast so with that then we're going to go to items somewhere in here should be you know I don't know where the electric heater would be it's not made in furniture it's not an unfinished it's not an artifact it's not a body part manufactured ah okay but that still tells me what it's not a textile a medicine a drug or a mortar shell okay where do you find on this list a an electric heater I've never had to look for one before it's not a weapon it's not a body part not an artifact it better not be an artifact it's not an unfinished it's not a furniture right furniture engine and furniture under furniture I'm a little confused about the furniture unfinished is things we make so is it a furniture I guess it could be raw resource mortar medicine textile drugs mortar um, and foods okay we're gonna change that to a furniture so items you're off you're on and let's just copy and paste that a whole bunch of times in so paste and I've already done it up there I thought I had to get a lot more specific than that so let's um, what on here J yeah so all the random furniture-ish pieces can all go into these places okay that's that and wait I've noticed silver has nowhere to go so temporarily let's just take two of these and make silver out of them so silver storage would be down in chunks now raw resources let's do silver right there and not there okay your silver let's copy you and I guess I can let this thing run while we're doing this and paste there's two silvers there's three silvers and let's do a uranium I know there's uranium hanging around so let's that's not what I wanted we have a rainy thunderstorm going on um, which one got the uranium you did not you did so we're gonna copy you and we have a fire going on so let's paste and paste all right where's that fire we hit over here rain's gonna put it out and mental break risk of Kaya you are what you're just kind of done with being out here okay you are still Kaya so now that we got here there's one last little touch to hit okay and you're gonna have a meal out here then you're gonna be ah, you can take the crankiness you're fine okay um, just notice the power over there. How are our batteries at the moment? And we're 1700. That's why we're diminishing or else the rainstorm The rainstorm must drop the power load or our wind is maxed out, which is good But we're still not getting ahead over here. We just don't have enough power sources So I don't know well if we ever get ahead of components Then maybe we'll move some of this out of here extend that greenhouse then I've got to come up with at least two more to handle the greenhouse. We could do that. That's 34, that's 29. Yeah. We can move this guy over to give us back this rich soil over here. Greenhouse right there. And do more power ish things out over here. This side of the river. I think so. I'm hearing a lot of noise. 
fire is out on our conduit. Oh, let's specifically... Well, that works. Okay, Catherine, when you're done doing that, I'll have you repair the conduit. Rather than hauling out a whole bunch of builders, one per each, you know. Long trips there and there. Okay, stopping and repairing and repairing and repairing. Eric, go back to whatever you were doing. Now, I don't think you can fail a repair. You could just take a long time to do it. I think you're fine there. And boy, it went to nighttime quick. All right, so we are all indoors over here. We're making lots of food. We're making lots of cloth, which means we can finally finish up all of our little jobs here. Grandma's room is done. There's one, two, three, four spaces left in here. There's three spaces left in here. And was there a whole room somewhere? Over here is marble tile. Okay, that room is unclaimed, which means we can get our medicine going again. Ooh, where am I? Hospital. Right there. 52. Everybody have some cloth. Okay. So, who was it that we got to do that one time? Was it George or Billy? George, um, character? Crafting 6? I think it was George. George is where right now? He is playing horseshoes, and he's going to bed soon. I have to remember to get him assigned to that again. Wind is still not as good. Okay. Rainy thunderstorm doesn't necessarily mean windy thunderstorm. We're doing great over here. We could swap batteries out again if we needed to. There's always that. Three components. That's enough to build a, a uh, um, one of these guys. Solar generator. I wanted to start moving this stuff out now, but I don't think so. You are one, two, three, four. And probably end it there. So one, two, three, four light one two three four five it would be the wall right up against these guys to do this so we just have to let them walk through because we're really killing the entrance here the, the access way huh i think i'd have to just run it short i think i would and we'll leave up that pathway there at all times that makes sense in fact as a reminder you know go ahead and just kind of do that won't necessarily build it right now, but just get that in place so that I can see it and, and remind myself what we're planning on doing there. But how do we deal with a nice main entrance here? You've got this diagonal going on right here. I really like the diagonal and I'm kind of thinking of a triangle right here. So too bad that's there. But that's nice and close. It's important. We could we could wall right across here though. We could. We could do something like that. And then a second wall, you know, for our, our double layer. And this could be actually that could the greenhouse could be right as part of it. There with a doorway right in here somehow. That's possible. So in that case, let's cancel all the wood there and there. And let's go ahead and with the granite like so and door this would be an auto door on the outside right there okay and then some kind of a diagonal through here and then drop down in and i would say all diagonal walls nice even diagonal and then we'll take the rock out that makes sense so i'll play with that one we're at 50 minutes it's probably a good time to shut this down i haven't been paying attention to what they're up to anyway. There's a fire on a conduit and fire. Now we've got a we got one last emergency to deal with here. Give me home zone. We can't have this area burn up and hit that one too. Any more fires that just hit and didn't get uh, uh, didn't get put out by the rain. Don't think so. Everything else looks good. So, yeah, we'll get a few folks out here to put all this out, save these trees, and and uh, maybe we'll start chopping these trees down. Because we've kinda, we have kind of cut out everything that's close to the base now. All these are, are uh, immature trees. So that one's done. Good. But it'd be nice to save and, and trim out. In fact, we can go ahead and get that one going. Because wood is what right now? Wood is only 700. And there's a lot of shelves they have to build. So let's architect and orders and chop that area too so there's there's a bunch of chopping jobs and nobody is coming up here to do this fire 
I guess I've got to find somebody. Gnarly, you are beating out a fire. David, you are repairing a power conduit. Now, go beat out a fire first. And Klaus, you are beating out a fire. So there's our fire patrol for the night. Natalia, you could help. You don't want nothing to do with it. Okay, that's fine. Grandma's going to walk up there nice and slow. And by the time she gets there, it'll all be done. You're cooking a fine meal. Ah, okay. Well, didn't expect that, but that works fine for me. And with that, I'm going to call this one done. This has been Noble Rambler, and I'll catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.